he's a top six or seven player in the NFL. You know, I think the, the reality for this move when it comes to the Colts is it places that I think there's four teams as we sit here today that are top of the AFC conference. Kansas City, obviously. Buffalo, obviously. Cleveland. And this puts Indy in that top four. Number two, I would put Carson Wentz into the MVP conversation. I believe in him and Indianapolis that much. And then three, I'd say this. This 2021 Colts team is going to look a heck of a lot like that 2017 Philadelphia Eagles team. You're talking about a top five offensive line and run game. That's what he had in Philly. Philly didn't have a star in 2017. They had like four or five really good pieces around them. That's what Indy has, top 10 defense. I think that this is a absolute home run for the Colts and something that the Eagles will absolutely regret two or three years from now. As spring training happens all over the country, Wait, is this in, really what, did, a home run? Did, did, did he say Carson Wentz is top six? He did. That's just, it, when it's right, when it's clicking, what do you think? He, top six? Are we, are, it, well, what, what do you want me to say? No, I, I'm, I'm, I'm asking. You're the football look, expert. Look, look, I, hey, I'm, look, like, I'm like, I'm like, hey, 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 Aaron Rodgers, want? Dak Prescott, Tom Brady, Russell Wilson, Lamar Jackson, Deshaun Watson. Well, no, no, hold on. You or you just mentioned quarterbacks. He said top six player, I believe. <laughs> player, <laughs> not quarterback. I can't. I get, we got to have Dio on. I, I but can't. Look, here, here's I can't what with I, this. Here's I what I would say about what Dan said there. Dan is absolutely right about similarities to the 27, 2017 Philadelphia Eagles. There's mm-hmm. similarities. There's a great offensive line. Jonathan Taylor at the running back spot. Good players on defense. Reich. Young, 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 uh, Frank Wright, young wide receivers in, in, in Michael Pittman Jr. Uh, so when you start to look at it on the surface, he's right about that. Now, whether or not they could get him back to that form, we have to see. Because Frank Wright was an offensive coordinator slash quarterback coach. He's not the offensive coordinator slash quarterback coach anymore. He is the head coach. So his priority is a little bit different. His focus can still be on Carson Wentz, but it's a little bit different because it's, his focus is not solely on Carson Wentz. His focus is now on 52 other guys, coaches. It's just a different responsibility than a position coach. Now, what I would say is when you look at Carson Wentz, if his mind is right and he's not broken from his time in Philadelphia – and he's not fragile, feel like if he makes a mistake in Indy, they're going to bench him or pull him, then he could become a success story in, in Indianapolis. And if not, then they'll be looking for another quarterback in a couple years too. But this top six stuff, I, it, you know Dan, man. Dan, yeah, puts okay. a lot of, Dan puts a lot of yeast on it. And when you start talking about he's a top six player, I mean, you listed the quarterbacks. Let's not even get into the other positions. Because if Kristen McCaffrey's in that mix – Where's he if he's healthy? Uh, You know, Michael Thomas from the New Orleans Saints. Where's he if he's healthy? I mean, so let's not, you know, uh, not even including Jalen Ramsey and Aaron Donald. D.O. just was excited there a little bit. uh, I got it. That's all. I got it. He's just a little excited. That's his guy. He backs Carson Wentz. He likes quarterbacks. I understand. I get it. Now, here's the thing. Key, you mentioned the word top six. That's a very apropos word because the Eagles actually are picking in the top six of the draft. We're not talking about top six players. We're talking about picking in the top six. They are actually at the number six position. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN Plus right now.